love the old, distant as the Milky Way. My shady amour, pretty little one that I adore, you're the only one my heart beats for. I wish that you were mine In the cafe Or sometimes on a crowded street I, I've been near you But you never notice me Hey, good morning, good afternoon Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental house with me, your host, Khadija. Listen, y'all, I just want to have a um, a conversation, and um, and, and this is real important to me because I don't feel like I was wrong, and I think I was very misunderstood, and I want to throw it by the family, and I want y'all to tell me. What you think? I was at a meeting tonight. And, you know, because there's so much, you know, racial tension involved in a lot of these, you know, community meetings and stuff. Uh, a lot of uh, my white brothers and sisters go totally overboard in trying to let, you know, black people know that they're not one of them. You know what I mean? The kind that that likes to, um, you know, kick up madness, right? And I, I respect that. However, I ran into a difficult situation this evening because um, I can't let stuff go like I used to do 20 and 30 years. I didn't got too old for that. You know what I mean? And I think that um, when you hit a certain age... <laughs> on the other side of 50, um, it's very hard for you to sit back and let bullshit go without making a correction. And excuse my French with that right there. Um, so there was a lady that said, you know, she was talking about, you know, how in her family she was raised to love everybody. And that's good. And and I'm very happy, indeed, that she wasn't raised in a family that um, practiced white supremacy. However, where we differ that is that when she said she's colorblind. And, and my question was, is this really an actual diagnosis of, you know, being colorblind? Or are you saying it to say that you don't judge people by their color. And she says, no, 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 I, you know, no, I don't have a diagnosis, but I don't. I don't see white, I don't see black, I don't see, I, I, and somehow, living in America, I can't get with that. I just can't. And I don't want to call, and didn't call the woman a liar, what I said was, listen, it's okay to see color. I see you as a white woman. I see her as a Latino, um, uh, uh, you know, Puerto Rican, or I see her as a, I see the different colors of the rainbow. My problem is when people become antagonistic and disrespectful because of a person's color. And there's nothing wrong with acknowledging our colors. That's why we made in different colors. So we can see the beauty of everybody. Not sit up there and say, you don't see what color I am. Because see, now you insulted me. Now I feel like you own some fake stuff. You don't go to the dealership and ask for any car. You don't go somewhere and say, well, I just want any kind of shirt. Or I just want any kind of dress. Or I just want any pair of shoes. You don't do that. 
And so you're not going to convince me. And I got to say this. And I know the person didn't mean no harm. But I saw her turn red from the neck up. And she didn't say anything else. And I didn't mean to hurt her feelings. But it's important that we understand and acknowledge and respect each other's beauty. And don't insult one another by saying you don't see the beautiful shades of a rainbow that God made us all. Because uh, there's, a, there's some scripture in the Quran uh, that says Allah made us into tribes and families that we may get to know one another. Okay? So now, and I'm not a, a religious person, but that scripture makes a lot of sense to me. Okay? We all different so we can get to know each other. Not be antagonistic. Try to disrespect somebody because of their color. Try to oppress somebody because of their color. And all the things negative that you can possibly do to a person because of their color. That's where I stand with it. How, what say y'all? Was I wrong? Do y'all see color? Or do y'all just see us just one monolithic color? Uh, you, uh. I, I see a reading rainbow. <laughs> what y'all see? Leave me your comment below. And hey, if you like what you hear, please get these likes up. Please like the uh, the, the, the content. Please uh, donate to the channel. Um, and if you can't do that in some ways, please watch the sorry ass uh, ads that they play on the channel. All that helps. Especially when you get videos demonetized. But I thank you. And um, I'm shoot me an email. If you got something that you want me to talk about. If you got something that you want to discuss. And let's have a dialogue. Okay. I'll see you in the next video.